Hello everyone and welcome back. It's Monday, which means we will be reading a brand new story together that's aimed at our younger readers. Today I've chosen the book Goldilocks and the Five Bear Families by Ollie Pike, which adopts the classic fairy tale to help teach us about family diversity. Now, let's join Goldilocks on her adventure. It was a sunny day when Goldilocks stepped out of her little house and began walking into the village. She was carrying a heavy bag full of letters. Hello, Mummy Bear. Hello, Daddy Bear. Hello, Baby Bear. This is for you, Goldilocks said, handing them a letter. Why, thank you, Goldilocks, they replied, and off Goldilocks went. Hello, Mummy Polar Bear. Hello, Mummy Polar Bear. How's your new baby? Goldilocks asked. Very well, thank you, said the Mummy Polar Bears. Goldilocks handed them an envelope and skipped off. Hello, Grandpa Koala Bear. Hello, Grandma Koala Bear. Hello, Auntie, Uncle, Brother, Sister, Cousin, Baby, Baby Koala Bear. These are for you. Goldilocks passed up enough letters for each of them. Thank you, they called down. Hi, Mixed Teddy Bear. I hope you and your family are having a lovely day. Here's a letter for you all. Goldilocks knelt down and delivered yet another letter. She could feel her bag getting lighter and lighter. Hello, Daddy Panda Bear. Hello, Daddy Panda Bear. Hello, Little Panda Bears. What are you doing? She asked as she handed out her final letter. We are going for a nice walk, the proud Panda Bears replied. Goldilocks smiled, waved goodbye, and then ran all the way home. It was easy now, her bag was completely empty. Now, Goldilocks lived by herself, and Goldilocks liked it that way. She would sometimes calmly relax. She would sometimes drink warm milk. She would sometimes quietly read. And sometimes, she would have a great big party with all her friends. Hello, Goldilocks, cheered all of the bears. This is for you. Happy birthday. The letters Goldilocks had been giving out were invitations. It was her birthday and she wanted to celebrate with all the different families in the village. So she did and together they enjoyed the most bear-tastic party. The end. Now, wasn't that a wonderful story? Tell me about your family in the comments below. And as always, take care and enjoy the rest of your day. Bye!